Hello, I'm Kim Gyeongje, the 16th president of the Korea Freedom Federation. The Korea Freedom Federation was founded in 1954 as the Korean chapter of the Asian People's Anti-Communist League by Seungman Lee, the first president of the Republic of Korea. The largest nationwide civic NGO organization, the Korea Freedom Federation, has since made significant contribution to the preservation of liberal democracy in the Republic of Korea. Now, the one million members of the organization are at the forefront of disseminating liberal democracy in North Korea, the last totalitarian dictatorship in the world, with the goal of realizing a unified Korea. I would like to take this opportunity to encourage the citizens of the United States, particularly President Barack Obama and the presidential nominees Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump to watch Operation Chromite, so-called the Incheon Landing Operation, a Korean film that has just been released in theaters across the U.S. One scene in the movie showed General MacArthur conducting an inspection of the front line along the Han River at the outbreak of the Korean War. While there, he meets and talks with a young Korean soldier who is fighting fearlessly against the nose. General McArthur says, when I told the young soldier that I could offer any help he needed, and he said, please, just give me enough rifles and ammunition to fight. I felt that he was a true soldier like me. We were soldiers. The historic Korean-U.S. alliance began with this exchange between General MacArthur and the dead young soldier. As promised, General MacArthur provided military support and launched Operation Chromite at Incheon, which had an estimated 1 in 5,000 chance of success at the time. This film is a story about the determination of the General MacArthur and the American citizens in undertaking Operation Chromite and the bravery of a young Korean soldier who infiltrated deep into the enemy territory to collect valuable military information before the launch of the operation. Now, over 8 million people in Korea, a country of the 50 million, have already watched the film. For my part, I was a student activist who promoted democratization in Korea during the regimes of Park Jong-hee and Chen Doo-hwan and left Korea for, to live in exile in Philadelphia and New York for a little more than 15 years. During this time, I learned about the true democracy and the American system of government in the United States and strived to apply this to my country, Korea. Continuing this work, I am now leading the Korea Freedom Federation with the goal of preserving liberal democracy in Korea. Currently, the United States and Korea are facing a nuclear threat of North Korea under the leadership of Kim Jong-un. In an effort to cope with this situation, the United States has decided to install Saab, an anti-ballistic missile system, defense system to protect Korea against the nuclear attack from the north. Much like Operation Chromite prevented Korea from the being communized about 60 years ago, Saad will now defend the Republic of Korea from provocation by the regime of Kim Jong-un. During the Korean War, General MacArthur and General Park son once said, we go together. In Korea, this phrase is, Kachi kapsida. President Obama also stressed the importance of working together, saying, Kachi kapsida, when he addressed the Korean much. college students during his visit to Korea. The Korea-U.S. alliance, represented by the phrase 같이 갑시다, 
ultimately prevented the communization of the Korean Peninsula based on the success of the Operation Chromite. During the war, over 36,000 U.S. soldiers lost their lives. The dramatic economic miracle in Korea that soon followed would not have been possible without the sacrifice of those soldiers. I, as a Korean citizen, convey my deepest gratitude to the citizens of the U.S. The film Operation Chromite expresses all Koreans' deep appreciation for General MacArthur and the U.S. soldiers who participated in the Korean War to defend Korea. Several screenings of the movie in the United States have invited American veterans who fought in Korea, and the U.S. branch of the Korea Freedom Federation will express its appreciation to all American veterans who participate in the Korean War. I would like to ask President Barack Obama and the presidential nominees Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump, who will lead the great nation of the United States of America to take the time to watch this meaningful film. Like the instance of the General MacArthur and the young Korean soldiers, the United States and Korea will always go together. Thank you very much.